Welcome to Fitness Sutra. In this swim sutra video, we will learn how to swim freestyle. Freestyle swimming is not only the easiest but also an effective way of swimming. With freestyle, one can swim at moderate pace without getting exhausted too quickly, which means one can swim longer with this technique. Consistent practice of freestyle swimming has immense weight loss benefits. Freestyle swimming is an all-round activity which benefit us in toning and building muscles which includes chest, stomach, arms and back muscles, increased upper body strength, increased flexibility and it builds a better posture. Before we move on, hit the subscribe button and turn notifications on so that you will be notified every time for the sutras we curate for you. Subscribing us will help you get gentle reminders to keep health and fitness your top priority through our videos. Your head should be in line with the rest of your body. With this, your body will float properly on the surface instead of sinking down. Do not try to look forward while swimming, rather look downwards. This will help you to swim better. Please watch our previous video on floating to know more. Click the i button in top right corner. There is no need to kick fast and hard. With firm body movements, you will have longer and better swimming experience without getting exhausted. With better technique, you will burn more calories besides enjoying your stay in water. Breathe sideways. Move your head sideways so that your mouth is slightly above the water surface level. When your mouth is above water surface level, you need to breathe in air through mouth. Remember, never ever try to breathe in through nose while swimming. You must use your nose to breathe out only when your face is inside water. For beginners, it is very important to have a good control over the fundamentals of swimming. Swimming is primarily a combination of three simultaneous activities, which done together turns out to be the best workout for any age group. Three activities are floating, breathing and limb movements. Floating knowledge help us to remain buoyant at water surface. Breathing in water help us to swim and float for longer period. Arm movements and kicking help us to propel forward in water. Our previous videos on these three techniques will help you get ready for swimming. Link for these videos are shared in the description. Breathe in sideways. Make sure you breathe in from both sides. If you lean your left hand forward, your face should move on the right side to breathe in through mouth. After that, move your face downwards to see bottom of the pool. With face inside water, you are breathing out through nose. Enjoy the air bubbles you exhale. Simultaneously, your right hand moves forward and comes back. Second cycle of limb movements begins with your left hand going forward again followed by the right hand. At this time, your face will tilt leftwards to breathe in. Since there is a limited time when your face is above water surface, both inhaling and exhaling together is not possible. That is why exhale should be done inside water. During this process, your legs will be doing continuous kicking to help your body propel forward. Hand movements assist you to provide direction to your swimming. If you swim without goggles, you cannot see what is going around you. Hence, your swim may turn up directionless. Roll your body assuming the central axis going through your head and toe. Rolling your body sideways along that axis will help you swim better. With this high elbow technique, you bend your elbow and pull water through your forearm and palms. The water exerts a force equal to the mass of displaced water which pushes your body forward. Make your palms wide when you push the water during this action. Do not try to extend the forward hand in air. This could lead to shoulder pain after swimming. Try to dip your hand in water midway between your head and full extension. Then perform stretching of the hand inside the water. Thereafter, take your hand backwards near your thighs. Simultaneously, the other hand will reach forward direction. Freestyle swimming is all about synchronizing breathing, inhale, exhale with your hand movements. You should begin with breathing sideways with every third forward hand movement. This counting will help you inhale from alternate sides. Inhale from alternate side means 
you will get balanced benefit of this great workout on your body. For a beginner, if you're not comfortable inhaling from both sides, it's okay to get a good control over inhaling from one side before graduating to inhale from either side. Practice makes one perfect. Keep practicing and keep improving. With good mentoring, learning becomes fun. Ask us for any question related to swimming. We will respond to your questions as soon as possible. Every like and comment received inspire us to create more useful content. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up. Tell us your swimming experiences in comments below. Share this video on WhatsApp, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and other social media platforms. This will help us to spread our vision of better health. Subscribe to Fitness Sutra for more sutras on health and fitness. Thanks for watching.